in the uh, in the book of Isaiah, chapter forty nine, Isaiah is uh, I guess what I would say grumbling and complaining, um, in a, in a way, about um, I don't I haven't memorized the scripture, but it's something along the lines of you know I've oh you know I've labored for so long and this and that and um, in verse four and then uh, he says, but I know, you know throughout basically my life is what's the purpose why am I here um, I've worked so hard I've done this and I've done that but he knows one thing is true and that's God is is there for him and um, God comes to him and he's he basically says Isaiah you're thinking too small he says think bigger um, there's more than just what you're what you're seeing but you've got to step out and you've got to think big and, and you've got to, you've got to take that chance that um, that uh, period of pure faith uh, which actually should be more than a period it should be a lifestyle um, God tells Isaiah what his plans are in store from him when he just says you when he just when he just steps out and um, and says use me you know, use me in, in your fullest, um, your fullest potential. So, so your prayer and my prayer for for you and for myself would be that God uses us to our full potential, and that and that what we see and that what we have and that and what we think um, we want to do with our lives, um, you know, if it's if it's for if it's bathed in the the glory and the grace of God. Um, God's plans are always going to be so much greater than ours, especially, you know, because he wants he wants to grow his kingdom. So, my point being with all of this, and if you want to look it up in Isaiah 49, um, go ahead. I think it's really good. Uh, if I had more time and I wasn't driving, I would read some. But um, my point is, with all of this, is it's okay to 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 dream big and to take big steps of faith but you know and it's okay to actually you need to say use me it's it's the most dangerous prayer as um pastor uh, rick warren says says it's the most dangerous prayer you'll ever pray is to say use me so we need to say use me and and that's encourage it's what we're supposed to do is to think so much bigger beyond ourselves that's okay and that's good but what's not okay is thinking too small and in in living a life where we never bust out completely of our shell we never sprout uh, from the seed that's that the spirits planted in each one of us um, it's not okay to live an underestimated life and to to live and die by that, um, but but that's what we need to do is is think big, dream big, take big steps steps of faith. Everything we do, we need to do it big, um, in the name of God. And and if it's based in that, God's plans, I I can promise, um, based off of pure Scripture. I'm not false teaching. I'm not doing any of that. Based off of Scripture, I can 100% guarantee you that God's plans for our lives um, when we step out in faith are, are so much greater than ours. Um, so with that in mind, um, maybe each day will will be a little bit less demanding if you think of things in that way that when you turn and you stop doing work for, for yourself and you start working for God that, um, that all of your whining and complaining and mine as well all of our all of our groaning uh, will be will be diminished and that we will um, will gossip less will argue less and and we'll just work harder as if uh, the Bible says as if working for the Lord his plans will be his plans will be um, revealed to us um, in many ways so with that in mind um, hope you have a good Wow, Wednesday already, and I will talk to you next time.